Hello friends, welcome back to the Selenium Tutorials. In the previous session, we learned how to open the Firefox browser and then close the Firefox browser. In this session, we'll be taking a very simple example, which is how to maximize the browser window. Now, the, this example is very simple, but it is very important because I have seen in very, various situations where my browser window, if it is not in the maximized state, few of the web elements, few of the web objects get hidden and there is a possibility that the automation script may fail because those web elements are not visible. So it is always a good practice to keep the browser window in the maximized state. So how to do that? I'll be showing you in this example. So once again, I would be creating a new class file. I I'm assuming that you have your Java project steady and it has been configured with the web driver jar files. So let's start to create a class. I would create, I would be clicking on this source folder. I would right click it, go to new class. I would name this class as max underscore window I intention is to maximize the browser window so I have given a logical name I would select this option public static void main string args click on the finish button so when my class would be loaded by default there would be a main method within the class because we had selected that option public static void main so here you could see on line number four this main method has come automatically on line number six, this is a comment which is given by the class file by default. I do not require it. It is harmless. But since I do not require it, I just delete it. Now I would start writing my code over here because Java executes from the main method always. So I'll start writing my code over here. So the first step as always, it is to create an object of the web driver class file. So let's do that. I write web driver. This is my class name, driver, this is my object name, the name could be anything of your choice. I have given the name driver, you could give it anything what you like. Is equal to new Firefox driver. So as you can see there are some red marks, red marks indicates error. I will hover my mouse to web driver where I could see my first error and Eclipse would suggest me how to fix them. So if I see the first option import web driver, if I click over here on line number one, the selenium dot web driver file gets imported and the red mark which was there on the web driver class has vanished. So we have successfully removed this error. Similarly, we could see another error on Firefox driver. If I hover my mouse over there, again Eclipse would help me to fix this error. So this is the fixes which are available. I would select the first fix, import Firefox driver. If you would see on the top on line number two, the Firefox driver has been included. And now I do not see any red marks, which means I have successfully removed the error. So my next step would be I need to go to a website I would select google.com how to do that I would use the driver object which we created in the first step driver dot I would go to get this get command helps me to navigate to the specific URL here I would give the URL name which URL I want to go to. So in my case it is google.com. So it is HTTP www.google.com. Now the Google, uh, the page would navigate to google.com. Now my intention is to maximize the browser window. So you will have to use this command to maximize. It is driver dot manage dot window if you could see i'm not typing the entire thing i'm taking the help of the editor the intelligence help helps me when i, I just type a few initial letters like 
W I N for window. The window things is displayed, and and I just press enter. In this way, you'll be able to minimize syntax error and spelling mistakes. So you should always take assistance of IntelliSense within the Eclipse editor. So the command is driver dot manage dot window dot. I need to maximize. So I write M A, and I see maximize has popped up, and I just press enter. So it gets entered on the screen. So my code is ready this is a very simple example which would just launch the browser go to google.com and then make, maximize it so let's see by executing it to execute i click anywhere on the screen sorry i right click anywhere on the screen go to run as select java application let's see how it works so as you can see the script has launched the browser it will navigate to google.com you could see it is connecting google.com page has opened now it would be performing the last step which is to maximize the browser the it is taking few seconds to load the page once that is completed the script would maximize this window So here you see the script has automatically maximized my, the window the execution of the script has completed and we have successfully maximized the window through this java code this is very simple only three lines first line would launch the firefox browser second line would go to google.com and finally the last line would maximize the browser you could see the browser is still in maximized state so guys we have completed this tutorial where we learned how to maximize a window it is very simple but very critical i say you should always keep the browser window in maximized states to avoid any un un uninterrupted errors